Hey guys, it's Nicole. Welcome to my channel, and if you've been here before, welcome back. And if you are new, I appreciate you joining me. If you haven't subscribed, I would love for you to subscribe to my channel and follow me on my fluid art journey. Um, just hit that subscribe button and throw me a like and a comment. Let me know what you think and uh, hit that notification bell as well. I would greatly appreciate it. So today's pour is a three do's and three don'ts challenge that I have with Kelly Marshall Art. So Kelly had uh, commented on one of my collaboration videos on, you, on, on my YouTube channel. Um, it was the collab I did with Amy's Acrylic Artistry and she had said, keep me in mind next time you wanna do a collab. And I was like, in my mind, I'm like, heck yeah, I'd love to do a collab. Um, so that was last month and we finally were able to get together after um, some things settled down a little bit and yeah, I was super excited that she wanted to do a collaboration with me. Thanks, Kelly. We decided that we were gonna go ahead and make our video releases a premiere. So you probably have already watched Kelly this morning, but if you haven't, the link to her video is going to be below in my description and I will also put it at the end of this video. So please go uh, check her out, watch her uh, video, show her some love for me. I would appreciate that. So the three do's and three don'ts that Kelly gave me were three do's. Do a Dutch pour, do use the color yellow, do a split color base. Three don'ts, don't use a square canvas, don't mouth blow, and don't use the color blue. So the mouth blowing part is going to be very tricky for me as I take no mouth blowing to mean nothing with my mouth, so not even my straw. So I will use my little handy dandy world's smallest leaf blower. I think that's what it's called. Um, instead of using my mouth and straw. I also want to mention two other collaborations that I have coming up. Um, on May 4th is one called May the 4th Be With You. It's a galaxy pour with um, 12 other artists. So I think right as I'm filming this, I believe we're gonna have 13 all together. The other collaboration I have coming up is with um, a face group I am part of called Little Pouring Art Family. And it's a ring pour using four different uh, colors. I've never done a ring pour before, so that will be also fun. So what I'm going to do is I'm gonna go ahead and get started. I'm gonna get the base down. I'm gonna speed things up for you. Um, I will check in with you at the end of the video to show you the end results. Um, I'll show you the wet and the dry results of the piece and I'll check in. So enjoy. Just kidding. I think I'll show you the colors first. <laughs> I forgot to show you the colors, duh. I think you might want to know, right? Okay, so we're using just plain old black, plain old white for the split base. And now the requirements were not for me to do a diptych. I decided I wanted to do a diptych just for fun, just because um, I haven't done it in a while and I thought I'm doing one canvas, why not throw another in there? Okay, so these are the colors that I'm gonna be using. This is for one, shall I say gorgeous. Um, this is Prism Pores Hot Orchid. So this might be, will be my first time using it. Sorry about that noise. This will be my first um, time using it and I'm super excited. God, it's so beautiful. Then I'll be using some titanium white, some 24 karat gold, and I'm gonna be using um, Pebio's Iridescent Orange Yellow. Super pretty color. And for my yellow, I'm using Lemon Yellow by Soho. Now, let's get going and let's get painting. And now I'm gonna say enjoy. We'll be back. Every hold me, take me higher.
out the sky onto my heart To cover up what I don't wanna show I let you in deeper than I Met anyone else before Fell in love with my broken pieces Took them all and made yours Didn't know what my heart be needed Skipping out and know I can't keep score When I lose my breath, boy, you got me breathing Oh, every little thing you do you hold me, take me here it is I'll get you down for some close-ups but if you didn't catch Kelly's premiere before mine please go check her out her link is in the description box below please go over and show her some love if you haven't done so already I would I would appreciate that thank you guys for joining me today if you would like to see more please subscribe Hit that notification bell to get notified when I post my next video. Hit that like button. Throw me a comment below. Let me know what you think. All right, till next time. Thank you. Bye.
Okay guys, here's the dry results. Let me just show this to you. I have the flash on. And you can just see all of that shimmer and sparkle. It's so pretty. It does not have any varnish or anything like that on it yet. This area I was a little concerned with because I thought it was going to look a little too muddy. It does a little bit to me, but I don't know. I don't think it's too bad. I think it dried pretty nice. What do you guys think? Let me know.